take me back to the time before the revolution, how you actually grew up in Yemen. What did, it, what did the Yemeni environment of, which was a tumultuous political environment of multiple civil wars that you lived through and mass <coughs> violence and mass casualties and killing. How did that affect you as a person? Look, uh, as I told you, and if you ask every Yemeni now, we know my country, our country very well. We know our history and we know even our current. Look, with all the chaos that you see now, it's nothing. If you see how the people are so connected and how the people, they are really manage themselves. So with all that you are talking, this is what, what you are talking, it's under the rule of the dictator and, the, and also now. But the reality that Yemeni people is strong and Yemeni people is so peaceful people and also they can organize themselves and manage themselves. So through these things, so I grow up and I saw, oh my God, there is a lot of crisis around me, a lot of crisis. And uh, my dad um, uh, nurtured me on liking you know, the politics. You know, I was with him every day, uh, uh, reading newspapers for him, discussing with him politics. And so it's from my childhood, I like politics. So, but always I ask him, what should I, what, what, how can we do? Our country is you know, collapsing like that. He gave me a poem and every time I, I repeated that, إِذَا الْقَوْمْ قَالُوا مَنْ فَتَنْ خِلْتُ أَنَّنِي عُنِيتُ وَلَمْ أَكْسَلْ وَلَمْ أَتَبَلَّدِي It means it's, if the people ask, who is the guy, who is the person who will solve this problem? I say, I am. So I am, I don't be lazy and I don't be naive. So since I was a child, I keep this you know, bowing and it was my method to work. So I am the one who will solve the, the, the problem. I am the, so every time I am, I am the one, I, I should carry the initiative. So when I saw the crisis around me in politics, in economy, in security, everywhere, I was the first question, how, what can I do? Not what should they do? What can I do? So uh, that is, that is, so, the, so that was, and also as I told the belief, believing on my dream, I'm believing on the people, on Yemeni people, they are so, look, with all the wars that happened in Yemen, Yemen didn't collapse until now. And if you are a researcher, and if you meet any a good researcher about Yemen, uh, the whole search about Yemen, they will say, oh my God, how amazing people, how strong people. If you have these problems in every, in another countries, you will say a total collapse society. So what is happening, that, that is fake Yemen, what you talk about, the real Yemen is a strong Yemen, it's a very respected people that are now, now they are facing <coughs> Saudi, Emirates, Iran and the superpower that's behind them. And we are willing to, and we will do it. We will be the victorious. We will be the one who created strong Yemen and the democratic Yemen. 